Happy New Year. It is episode 25 of Beards and Barbells happening to you on January the 7th, 2021. And we just want to talk to you about three things that won't change in the new year. So, so much has changed uh, in the past year. We've had lockdowns, we've had closures, we've had online school, we've had just about everything you can imagine happen. Um, but don't let these three things, um, loot, don't let these three things that won't change um, happen to you uh, in the new year. So, Self-care is uh, non-negotiable. Many of us burn ourselves out taking care of everyone else. Um, I'm a kind of a victim of this too, taking care of all the other clients and not taking care of myself. So sometimes I feel like I'm not working out as much as I want to or I'm not eating as well as I should. So uh, self-care is one of the things that you need to um, focus more on. So remember, you can't pour from an empty cup. Think about what then. Think about what they say when you board an airplane. Put your oxygen mask on first. So help yourself so that you can be the best version of you to uh, to others and help other people. So if you're putting everyone uh, in front of yourself, a lot of times we end up going to sleep early, burn ourselves out, eat unhealthy foods. And so therefore you're kind of the last man um, to think about and therefore we burn out and um, kind of wear ourselves out first and foremost. So number two is the other 165. The other 165, if you're making to the gym three days a week before the pandemic, your results were largely going to be dictated by the other 165, 165 hours in the week. So factors like sleep, stress, hydration, nutrition have a lot more to do with your, um, do with how your clothes fit than those TRX rows that you did yesterday. So the same is true now, even more so. So yes, it's important to get your workouts in, but it's even more important to be accountable for what happens during the other 165 hours uh, in the week uh, with that. So embrace it. Do it. Do what you can for that. Um, Just make sure that you're making yourself more of a priority um, and then getting proper nutrition, sleep, hydration, food intake, workouts as well, as well as other things that are on your list. So the simpler, the better is number three. When it comes to exercise, the basics are always best. So expensive, elaborate equipment like Peloton bikes and, and super gaudy machines that are super expensive that nobody really knows how to use are not only unnecessary, to take away from the desired outcome. So become the best best of the basics and the rest will take care of itself. I'm not saying that you don't need those Peloton bikes or whatever it may be. Um, sometimes body weight and resistance bands may be a uh, better suit for you now. And then as things kind of settle down or you may have more time to use for the Peloton bikes and the other gadgets uh, might be better suited for you. So it's pretty simple. Take care of yourself. Pay attention to what happens in the 165 hours a week uh, when you're not in the gym. And keep it simple, stupid. Keep it simple, things will work out for the better. So what's one thing you've learned or one practice you've adopted during the pandemic that will stay with you after it's over? Shoot me a reply, let me know uh, what it is. I'd love to hear about it uh, with that. So it's what's one thing you've learned or one practice you've adopted during the pandemic that will stay with you uh, when it's over? Uh, That may be reading more, maybe going to sleep longer. Uh, Maybe it's nine hours of sleep instead of eight. Uh, maybe your meal prepping, uh, whatever it is, we'd like to hear about it. So hopefully you find this helpful on episode 25 of Beards and Barbells coming to you with three things that won't change for the new year. Have a good day, guys, and we'll talk soon.